The winter breath that occurs when we breathe and it's cold outside is comprised of water and heat. The cloud of vapor is massive through the mouth while it is nearly non-existent through the nose. Nasal respiration can help us avoid unnecessary loss of water and heat. A Swedish study showed that we lose 42% more water when we exhale through the mouth compared to through the nose. The authors conclude this study showed that the net water loss increased by 42% when the breathing mode was switched from nasal to oral expiration in healthy subjects. Increased water and energy loss by oral breathing could be a contributing factor to the symptoms seen in patients suffering from nasal obstruction. In other words, if you don't use your nose, it may lose its function. Water is also needed in the lungs and airways in order to keep the windpipes from drying out. When the water decreases, the lungs become more easily irritated and we become more susceptible to bacteria and viruses and we react more severely to dust, mold and other damaging particles in the air. So in conclusion, close your mouth and breathe through your nose to keep your airways hydrated. You can read more in my article Improve Your Breathing, Improve Your Asthma on ConsciousBreathing.com dash Improve Asthma. If you like this video and want more people to find out about it, please hit the like button below. Your daily breathing habits lay the foundation for your health, energy and harmony. It is a real superpower and to unleash it and thereby reach your full potential, make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just press the conscious breathing symbol to the right of me. Also remember to press the bell button below the video to receive alerts every time I go live or post new videos. You may also want to click on the link in the description below the video to receive two free chapters of my book Conscious Breathing. Thank you so much for watching, breathe better and feel better.